This is part one of a three-part exercise in which we are converting full names in one column into separate first and last name columns in Microsoft Excel. This is a pretty common task in Excel. We are going to take a list of full names, both first and last names, separated by a space here in column A, and break the full name out into individual first and last names in two separate columns, column C and column D. We'll do this two different ways. The first way is by first finding the position of the space in the full name and storing that in column B. The second way, which will be a bonus part to this exercise, will be extracting the first and last names into two columns without the need to use column B. Here are your action steps to complete this task. Open up Excel and start a new spreadsheet. Type the headings and names exactly as you see them on my spreadsheet. Don't worry about font, font size, or background colors for now. Pause the video now and resume it again when you have completed these steps. Okay, now let's take a look at column B. We want to use the find function to determine what position the space is in in each of the names in column A. Start in cell B2. I'll give you a hint. If you do it right, you should get five as your result for Carl Houston. Here are your action steps to complete this task. Use the find function in cell B2 to find a space in the name in cell A2. Once you have the correct formula, copy and paste cell B2 to cells B3 through B6. Pause the video now and resume it again when you have completed these steps. Okay, let's look at what you should have typed into cell B2. I'm going to click in B2 here. We're going to use that find function. So equals find the left parentheses and we're looking for a space. And remember that has to be in quotes. So you should have put quote space quote and then a comma, and then within text, we're looking in cell A2, and then a right parenthesis to end our function, and there's that five we're looking for. So the space in Carl Houston's name is in position number five, and then I told you to click here and copy and paste this down, which you can do uh, the most simple way is just to grab that drag handle and drag that down, and now we have the space position for each of the, first, uh, each of the full names in column A. That's it for this exercise. In the next exercise, we'll extract the first name and place it in column C.